channel I hope you're all well I'm just going to address the obvious if you can hear music I'm really sorry it's my neighbor they've been blasting music for an hour straight now and I've like I'm English I don't complain I kind of just like complain to other people and moan about it so if you can hear that music I really really do apologize but hopefully I'm talking loud enough to talk over it so today as you probably can tell by the title is my decluttering makeup uh, collection kind of thing I've got rid of um, a lot of stuff. Um, I got rid of more than this but these are the things that I can give away to you guys because I haven't used them or anything. So you will see most of it in the video but these things are um, the remainder. So basically what I'm going to do is just insert all the clips now of my decluttering and then at the end of the video I will just summarise what I have and then what I want you guys to do is just comment down below what you want from it. Um, I'm going to give it two items max per person just so that everyone else can get something. So yeah, if you want to check out like shades or anything like that I'll try and link as much things um, down below as well. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and Let's begin decluttering. Okay, so this drawer is probably the reason why I wanted to do my clear out the most. This drawer is just ridiculous. In this drawer, I mainly keep eyelashes, um, cleansers, face wipes, pads, makeup removers, contacts. This drawer is just like a random drawer, but I know everything that's in this, but with my new, um, storage vanity thing i'm actually gonna like divide things up so i'm gonna start to clear this out um i'm gonna keep these because i use these every single day sorry i didn't know i wasn't in the shot i use these to cleanse off my makeup and tone and all that my wipes are an essential thing i just got some loose pads as well that's great so lashes 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 more lashes more lashes it's so crazy i have so many lashes but like the chance that i use like any others like is slim to none okay so i have the nyx brush cleaner i'm actually gonna keep this because i know i haven't used it yet um but i do want to try some new brush cleaners out i'm so in love with like the solid one which is in like um a, a tub thing and it's like a bar of soap and it's incredible but i want to start using ones like this for like um mixing it with like when I use eyeshadow brushes like in the middle of tutorials and that so I'm going to keep that I'm going to keep my Charlotte Tilbury eye makeup remover these lashes I'm going to get rid of and I'm not going to give them away because they're just like nasty like that's a no-no more lashes I've got some um fake bindies as well look at all these lashes guys Ugh. there's like four packs there five packs there and a plaster that just will not move there we go okay stay that's rubbish this is my contact solution so they're staying my Kat Von D setting spray my Urban Decay makeup setting spray like a mini traveling one my Garnier eye makeup remover love that oh my god more lashes oh these lashes I've got like a bit missing can you see like there so they're gonna go in the bin my bubblegum lip scrub oh my god oh my god face paint oh is that a new one? Oh my god this is a new one but we keep it we keep it okie dokie so I just don't even know what to do my Smashbox primer water this is a brand new one I have the big version already I got this in my Sephora favorites um like package thing and it came with like loads of sample things so I'm probably gonna give this one away this is my favourite thing in the whole entire world. I am planning to do a skincare review, not review, skincare routine. Um, so I'll go into more depth about that. But, oh my god, I'm gonna keep that. Cinema Secrets makeup remover. Um, Freedom Perfecting Moisturiser. I've never used that. I'll probably give that away as well. 
my Charlotte Tilbury moisturizer. I've used this a couple of times. I wasn't really a fan of it. Um, but I feel weird giving moisturizer away. So I think I'm going to put him in the maybe pile for now. Uh, the Be Pure Micellar Water. I don't really use this. If you guys can see, like, I don't know if you guys can see, like, nothing really of it has been used. So I don't know if I give that away or not because, but it goes on a pad so it doesn't go on my face. I'd have to think about if I give that away or not. Um, the Body Sharp Body Butter. Um, it's never been used. It's just kind of like sunken, stayed to like that shape. So I'll give that away because I'm not really a fan of that. Oh my god, I have to it already. Uh, Makeup Store Skincare System. Oh my god, I forgot I had this. I got this from Malta. Oh my god. I'm going to keep this. I need to like get this new system going so I know what I've got. Okay, Charlotte Magic Cream Treat and Transform Moisturizer. Again, I've used this like once and I didn't really see a difference. I, I want to give this away, but like, can you give moisturizers away? I don't know. We'll just put them to the side. Then my Miller, mm, ugh, my Ella Masca Hydroveil, we will keep. Oh my God. Tissues, lashes, the Body Shop Unperfumed Eye Gel. I don't want that, so I'll give that away. Glitter, glitter. Body Shop Vitamin C Instant Glow Enhancer. I don't want that. Makeup Store System Cream thing. Henna! A hand gel. I like to use this before I do videos sometimes. And like just in general, like when I'm editing for ages, just to moisturize. Nip and Fan. Nip and Fan. Nip and Fab. Dragon's Blood. I'll keep that. My little sample thing is usually go there. Here we go. More contact solution. We keep those. <laughs> we keep those. These are like um, Saint Tropez um, body uh, tan in, in the shade medium dark. So I'm gonna give those away because I've got like big versions of fake tan and I don't really use that one. My Mac Fix Plus. Now I don't use Mac Fix Plus because it breaks me out and I'm not about that life. But a fair amount of it has gone. But I know that this is quite expensive and some people don't really want to use this. So I will probably give this away. I don't like it because it breaks me out like I said. So that's going to go in the giveaway. <sighs> tea tree. TCP. These are all for piercings. Nivea. Which is for holidays. So we keep there. Oh my god. I've just got so much stuff. More face paint. Oh my god. That's old face paint. Eyelashes. Eyelashes. We just have one. I don't know where the other one is. Wow. More eyelashes, more eyelashes. My primer water, is that the lid for it? Nope. Okie dokie. I don't really like to keep lids um, because I find it hard to. Saint Tropez Self Tan Sensiting Bronzing Lotion Face. Ooh, keep. Um, and then this is just like plasters and like things. So we've got a Burberry Fresh Glow Sample. But I'm gonna keep that for me. And then we've got like some Dior samples. So I'll give those away. I don't mind getting that way. And then Inglot foundation cover up. I'll give those away. And then an under base mas mystique. I don't know. A base fan thing from Inglot as well. And then another bloody body butter. This one again has been untouched. Oh no, I've touched this one there. So I have to keep that. But I'll probably get rid of it. Um, because I don't like them that much. They're too like, I don't like thick things. My EOS lip balm, and then, oh my god, so many lashes, guys. I need to find pairs for these or get rid of them, like, this is ridiculous. I can't lie, I don't use this. This is a massive body butter. I like, I have used it, but I don't use it anymore. Oh my god, there's a hair that's so disgusting, I'm so sorry. But it's a great place, like, I usually use this. Like, I leave it where it was, and then I put that on top, and then I put, like, all my lashes on there. I don't know why. I've just always done that. So, I tend to keep these two, like, always. Like, I think it's just, like, a thing that I do. A lip gloss to prime my lips. A lip balm to prime my lips. We keep those. My lighter for my candles. I don't smoke. More pad. My pills. <laughs> and then in here... Okay, there's, these are all just cotton sticks everywhere. Jeez Louise. In here, I just have all my contacts. Um, I get quite a lot of questions asking where I get my contacts from. I get them from a place in Arndale, which is in Manchester. Um, and it's a place called Duty Free, and that's where I get all my contacts from. I love them. Um, so, yeah, that's them. And then I just keep some 
eyelash glue um what is this freedom gel i don't know what that is sharpener and stuff like that so yeah that's basically my clear out of in here so i'm gonna give away quite a lot of stuff actually and then the rest i'm keeping obviously so then like as for my primers i kind of like use all of them really um there are some like that i don't really use so like i have my nars um uh, pro prime smudge proof eyeshadow base and i've used this once uh, but i don't really use it anymore because um i don't really use eyeshadow primers in general because i don't really have a problem with eyeshadows creasing or anything like that so i'll probably be getting rid of him and then i have like my benefits prime time um i've only used this once and i don't really like the way it finishes on my face i don't like the feel of it so i will be getting rid of that then I have the MAC Prepper Prime Natural Radiance Base. Um, this is like a yellow base, but this breaks me out because as you guys know, I have really sensitive skin, especially for MAC face products, so I'll be getting rid of that. So then I have two of this Smashbox Photo Finish Primers. I have one Luminizing one and Pore Minimizing one. I've only used these both once. I really wasn't a fan for me personally. I did get the uh, usual one that they have and I liked that. But for I, I have other Pore Minimizing ones and more uh, Luminizing ones that I prefer. So I'll be getting rid of those too. And then that is pretty much it for in here. Uh, the other ones that I use um, and I go back to every now and then. So that's it for this one. Okay, so now we've gone to um, handheld. So if it's a bit shaky, I do apologize. Um, so this drawer is one of the reasons why I've wanted to do this clear out because uh, I have a lot of things that I don't like or don't use and have dried up, such not. Um, all in the back we have my lashes, but I'm gonna keep all those because um, those are lashes that I've purposely bought because I like. Um, stay tuned for my makeup collection, which I will go through every single pair of them and what they are. So over here we have my brow things. Um, I'm not really a fan of uh, drugstore brow things. I don't think that they're very good personally. So I probably sorry, please excuse my hole in my pajamas. That's just not there. Um, so I probably will be getting rid of this sleek one here. And um, I use the L'Oreal one mainly for the mirror every now and then, and sometimes I use the powder. So I'll keep that just in case. I go back into it and use it. Um, I have one here which is from, I think this is Barry M. Um, it's never been opened and it's a dark brown shade so I'll be getting rid of that because I didn't really, like I used one that was in a different shade and I didn't like the texture of it or anything. Um, and everything else I do pretty much use, if I'm completely honest, I do. Then I have all my brow wizards which I use because I like change um, colors of my hair. As for my pencils, um, I do tend to use the majority of them, so I won't be getting rid of any at the moment. And then moving on to here, this is the one that I've been so excited about doing. Like every time I've done my makeup recently, I've been like, oh my God, I need to do this declutter so I can get rid of some of these because I have a lot and I don't need them. I know that. So I'm going to be putting the ones that I'm going to keep over here just so I can separate them. My roller lash that has been just used and abused, I'm going to get rid of this, not give it away. Um... I'll probably be giving away the MAC Zoom Lash Mascara, which has never been used either. I have another Benefits Roller Lash. I'm going to chuck this away because I do have another one and I think the ones that I have have dried up. I'm going to be giving this away. I got this in one of my... Um, benefit calendars i have a full size version so i don't need this one so i'll be giving this away i will be getting rid of this because i've opened it and i haven't used it again and it's pretty much dried out now okay i have another benefits the real tester so i'm giving that away as well and then another max false lash extreme so then i think this is the one that most people have been most excited about because i've mentioned a few times that some foundations and um, that i own don't actually like suit my color um so i'm just going to go through the ones that i'm probably going to get rid of i will be getting rid of my Giorgio armani luminous silk in the shade 7 just because i am the shade 6.5 um i won't be giving this away because it is pretty much done and i have had it for nearly two years so i don't really think anybody would want it anyway The next one is the Marc Jacobs uh, Genius Gel in the shade 65 Fawn Medium. This one's just a tad bit red. It isn't really like completely red toned, but it's just a bit tad red for me. So I will be giving that away. 
So the next up is the Kat Von D uh, Lock It Tattoo Foundation. I have used it once, it doesn't have its stopper anymore. This is in the shade Light 49. I have brought my actual colour so I will be giving this away. The next one is the YSL, uh, I think this is the Touche Clat maybe. Uh, this is completely the wrong shade for me, it's extremely red. I'm really upset about it because I paid a lot of money for it. So I will be giving this away. So it's in DC. The next one is the Rimmel Wake Me Up Foundation. Again, this is super red tone, so I will be giving this one away. Uh, as for shade, um, I don't really think it says a shade on it. Oh, no, it does, sorry. 400 Natural Beige. I will be giving that away. Getting rid of some of my foundations. Finally, I've got so many. <laughs> The next one is my ALF Flawless Finish Foundation. I'm going to chuck this away just because I've had this for two years and I don't really want to give it away to somebody. Um, so I'm going to chuck this away. And then I think that's it for up here um, for now. Yeah. <laughs> and then I have this drawer. Um, honestly, I do generally use 99% of this so I'm not actually going to get rid of anything for now um, just because I know what I use and everything so I'm going to keep this all in here for now um, and then if I get rid of anything I will keep you guys updated so then here is where like <sighs> crazy things happen kind of thing um, the chance of me getting rid of the majority of uh, the chance of me getting rid of like anything in here is probably slim to none um, surely because when I buy like eyeshadows or pigments or glitters or anything like that it's because I want to use them um, so yeah we're probably not gonna get rid of anything in there if I'm being honest and the next is just the same and then I have lip products which I'm not gonna get rid of because that's really unhygienic um, and if I get rid of them I will just uh, bin them so in here I have like uh, powders and such not um, there is one thing that I definitely wanted to get rid of and it was this so this is the MAC uh, mineralized foundation loose in the shade um, medium dark. I, you guys know I love the light one, which is this, but I'm going to get rid of this one just because I've never used it and I don't think I will. I don't really like the idea of putting loose powder on like my face face. Um, so I'm going to get rid of this. I then have this MAC blush, which was from one of the collections. I can't remember which one it is. It's in the shade Hypnos. I've never used this. I don't, oh my God, it just wants to fall. I've never used this. I don't think it doesn't look like I have, um, but I don't think I ever will either. So I'm going to get rid of this. Look, there's me. Hey. So moving on to my palettes. Um, if I'm honest, I probably don't use them as much as I should, but at the same time, I still enjoy having them. There are a couple I will um, get rid of though. So the first one that I'm probably gonna get rid of is this one. This is the Too Faced Natural Matte. Um, Eyeshadows, I think I've only used a couple of the shades like once, but I wasn't really like keen on them and to keep all of them just seems a bit greedy So I'd like to give them away to one of you guys. So that's the first one to go So then this is just like the overview of like everything that I'm getting rid of I know there's a few things that I haven't included and that's because they've been in like a bag that I'm getting rid of before um, So I just do a quick like skim through things. So there's a Saint Tropez a body tan a freedom skin thing max fix press Kat Von D a foundation YSL foundation, an eyebrow pencil slash eyeliner, my NARS primer, sleek brows, MAC mascaras, Marc Jacobs foundation, uh, MAC prep and prime, but bleh, 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 minerals prime time, MAC loose foundation, smash box photo finish, two their real mascaras, a pore minimizer, this Ellie Golding, um, eye palette I picked up one oh, I picked up one of each and I prefer the other one and I'm just going to give this one away that's a sample um some lip balms from Benefit NARS blush MAC blush Too Faced palette an eye serum Smashbox primer water Rimmel foundation Be Pure micellar water Rocketeer blush uh, another tan thingy a pair of eyelashes Benefit's What's Up um Charlotte's Magic Cream a body butter and a vitamin E body shop and then just some um, samples over here so this is just the overview for you guys so then that was all of my decluttering makeup as you can tell that's probably how I have accumulated all of this stuff so I'm just going to go through it all again with you guys and show you guys what you guys can have. Like I said at the beginning of the video, it is two items per person. All you have to do is just comment down below what it is you would like and that is it. So yeah, let's go and get into what there is. 
so there are going to be things that I haven't shown you that I've kind of like picked up before or like I forgot about. Um, basically I picked up the whole range of the MAC Retro Matte Liquid Lipsticks collection and there were four shades that I just did not think that would suit me. I haven't swatched them and I haven't used them. So there are four. I have the shades Dance With Me, Quite The Standout, To Matte With Love and Rich and Restless. Then I have a NARS blush mini tester in the shade Orgasm. I have an OCC lip tar, which is the matte one. This one is in the shade, what shade are you? Lament. I already have one of these and then I brought one by accident thinking that I didn't have it, so I have this one. I have a pair of lashes that I got free one time when I brought some hair. Um, and they're just like black wispy ones with like purple bits in there. I know many people won't like these, but if you want them, they're yours. I have a MAC Ellie Golding palette. Um, I brought both of the palettes and I only liked one. So you have the four shades here, then you take this bit off and there's another shade behind, which is like a face shade. I'm not gonna do it because I nearly broke mine when I was trying to open mine. So that one's up for grabs as well. Then I have a, a Body Shop Elderflower Unperfumed Eye Gel that's never been used. The B Pure Micellar Water, it's only been used by so much, so the rest of it is yours. Then I have a little mini Benefits What's Up highlighter. I have a MAC blush, which was from one of their collections. I think this was the Wash and Dry collection, maybe. I can't remember. And it's in the shade Hipness. The MAC Fix Plus Prep and Prime spray, and it has been used by that much. I have the YSL Le Tint Touche Clat <laughs> foundation in the shade BR60, which looks like this. This was just super red toned for me. The MAC Prep and Prime Natural Radiance Base Lumiere thing in the yellow shade. Um, I used this twice, so there should be a lot of product left in there. A Freedom Perfecting Moisturizer for acne prone skin. A Benefits Rocketeur Blush Sample. A little sample of the Smashbox Photo Finish Primer Water. The Kat Von D Lock It Tattoo Foundation in the shade Light 49. The Marc Jacobs. Herbs Genius Gel in the shade 64 Fawn Medium. The MAC Mineralize Foundation Loose in the shade Medium Dark, which has never been used before. The Too Faced Natural Matte Eyeshadows, which I think only, th oh, which only three of them have been used and it's like swatched. The Smashbox Photo Finish Luminizing Primer. A Benefits Hula uh, Ultra Plush Lip Gloss. Two of the Saint Tropez Everyday Medium Dark Gradual Tans. A Beauty Bay uh, lip gloss in the shade Berry Shine. A tester of the Benefits They Are Real Mascara. A Body Shop Vitamin C Moisturizer. A Bare Minerals Prime Time Foundation Primer, which I've used twice, so there should be a lot left in there. Another Benefits They Are Real Mascara. Some samples which I showed you at the end, like there's Dior ones, Inglot ones, and yeah. A Charlotte Tilbury Charlotte's Magic Cream Treat and Transform Moisturizer, which I think I've I've used once and I've like dug my nails into it, but that was about it. A Smashbox Pore Minimizing Primer. A Benefits Sugar Bomb Ultra Plush Lip Gloss. A MAC Zoom Fast Black Lash Mascara Sample. A MAC False Lashes Extreme Black Mascara Sample. The NARS Eye Primer Pro Prime Smudge Proof Eyebrow Brace. I've used this maybe like two or three times. I just don't feel like I need eyeshadow primers personally, so that's why. And then finally is a brow pencil from Barry M and it's in the shade brown, I assume. Ah, oh, light to medium. So then that was it guys. So like I said, just leave comments down below of what you want. And again, only two items per person maximum. So yeah, like I said, just get your little comments in and when everything's gone, everything's gone. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, then give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to comment, share and subscribe to my channel. And until next time guys, I'll see you guys soon. Bye.